What's going on you beautiful humans? Welcome back to another Crypto Gaming Boy. On this channel we cover all things gaming and earning crypto. That is play to earn games and passive income. Um, this is a continuation video from a uh, last video introducing you to Phantom Galaxies. This is a NFT game that is coming to PlayStation as well as um, consoles, uh, also other consoles such as Xbox and uh, windows of course uh, currently i'm on my pc and this is what i'm playing it on um currently i run as a few issues but i'll go through all the little details um and just to just in case if you were lucky enough to get this free nft and also lucky enough to be honored with the beta um, um download and test congrats so there were some issues i've seen in the community people talking about and not be able to get in but i will touch on those and um how i found out what works because there's two different there's a launcher to download and there's another launcher to download the game to play the game not download the game sorry so yeah so currently we are sitting at our subscribers at 572 subscribers we want to thank each and every one of you who subscribe especially the ones who comment and like you guys are greatly appreciated without you guys we won't be able to um to get this far so thank you remember at 1000 subscribers we'll be giving away three out of a four yeah that right i did it right i think i did that right yeah three out of the four um axes that we have that you you check my last videos um uh, crystal that won that congrats skin crystal for winning the power fish um but another lucky winner will be able to win a full team to start the game straight off from scratch so let's get right into this uh, right now um if you have not been here before please hit that like hit that subscribe and turn on that notification bell right there so you can get more cool content that i'll be covering for anything to play to earn um so let's move on to the game let's just want to do a little bit setup so i'll be back in a couple of seconds all right, all right guys just moving on along here everything seems to be working fine so I'm just going to do everything from scratch for you. So this is the downloader, um, the the launcher for the game to download the game. And this is the actual um, launcher to play the game. So once you go to the website here, you'll see a download, select download, it asks you to connect your wallet. Once you connect your wallet, then it, it will allow you to download this information and it will also provide you i don't need to do this because i did this already it will also provide you with a unique code which will be here um the thing with this yes i showed you guys my code last time but there's no possible way for you to gain access without having access to my wallet so unfortunately um for you but uh, fortunate for myself and any other one who, any other person but just to know this um unique code all generates um every single time you log in so it'll never be the same so you have to reconnect your wallet all over again so good luck to all of you who try to bamboozle people because it's not possible and i love what um, blowfish did with this this is an uh, amazing um strategy and how they're securing their wallets as well as how they're securing the access to our game so once i think i selected this yet all right so once i open up the game here let's give it a few seconds this is what it's going to look like they're going to say play now when i say play fan, uh, phantom galaxy it normally comes up with an error message from that error message um it is fine not a problem what we normally do is just don't open it from this app you just double tap this application here and then it will automatically open this up for you from there um you should be able to hear the game just now earlier which i am going to um switch the screen over her there you go so uh, as you notice you might hear the ins and outs when i play the, try to play the game because um whenever you select on the screen like i'm going to click it now then you will hear the music play so you will hear the music play and stop every so often. I do apologize for that. There's nothing I can do. I have to, you know, change my settings and switch um, different things for you guys here as well. So you can see where I'm, as I switch to the different scenes here on my OBS. So currently I am working with um, my Xbox controller. All I have to do is quite simple. If you go back to the game, I'll show you guys once you come here. You go to your options from your options you go to controller from your controller you just plug it into your pc 
and it will automatically register your Xbox controller. Ah, there you go. And you see I'm moving. I don't think I can show this um, at the same time, but I am moving my Xbox controller and it's moving on the screen here. So there you go. So it's really quite simple. It does have an option for the uh, PlayStation as well. So you can swap over to the PlayStation. You may see my mouse has disappeared, but you can swap over to the PlayStation controller if you want. Um, you can work, check out your aim speed or aim, aim assist strength, which I don't think this is necessary, but we just keep it at five. I think what it was aim assist on or off. Uh, I'm, I'll just see how my skill is going. Let me click on the rumble if that's possible. Um, inverted. I don't like inverted. I don't think I'm an inverted type of person. Um, horizontal invert. Up is up, down is down. Left is left, right is right. Um, invert. Vertical, no. The graphics are high, not a problem. Keyboard and mouse, I'm not using that right now. Uh, visual screen full, that's fine. Audio is fine. I checked that already. And difficulty. No, put it on normal. And we could go hard, but you know, just let's, let's try normal. See what the, um, the developers have to say about this game. Um, screen shakes, yeah, let's give that. English, fine. Um, rolling ship, auto rolling ship. I'm not sure what that is, but I think everything is okay. So you can just go straight here and quit or just check out the NFT. This is the NFT I was telling you guys about um, right here. This is the free NFT that you received from um, the connecting your wallet to their website. You can, I think you can still connect your wallet to the website. I'm not sure the the benefits of it now because there's nothing else there. But as you, it could be a possibility that you do connect it still because looking at here, I can take the perception that um, episode one, two, and three they will be providing to us um, over time. Uh, I know that they provide an additional one the same time they drop. Um, Hell, hell burned, hell burned, hell, hell burned. Anyway, once they, they after they dropped this 001 uh, NFT, they also dropped another one for the group called the Hopeful. So they have a Discord group called the Hopeful. And how that works is if you were in there, I think the first 5,000, I think it was first 5,000 uh, members who joined the Discord got anointed to join that group called the hopeful and they received another nft as well i'm not sure what the perks are behind that one but it's you know snooze you lose i didn't get there i wasn't one of them i found out about it when i found out about it so just moving on this is the nft the free nft that you you would have um received and you could have dropped into your wallet as i mentioned i showed you it on my phone and it's already connected to my wallet so it showed you here in the game so we're moving to load game. There's nothing there, obviously, because I haven't started the game, but I will be starting the game now. I'm going to give myself about 30 minutes or so. Right now we're in um, eight minutes in and we're just going to go from here um, to 30 minutes because I don't want to be a drawn out um, video for you guys. Um, but let's start this game. Oh, character selection. Epic. Um... What are we working with? Male and female, that's standard. Go with male. I'm a dude. No, I don't think I want those names. Let's call it. Uh, gaming boy. What am I doing? What am I doing? Oh. Hey. All right, maybe I should just remove the spaces and that should be a okay. Oh my God. So sorry. I don't know what's that, what's going on. What's going on? Why is it I can't tab across or something? Cancel. Delete that. Oh, oh my god. 
not. Okay, there's some weird thing with the controller and the keyboard. If you tap left or right, if you tap right right now, it goes over to the girl. If you tap left, it goes over to the to the guy. So I'm just trying to edit this information and it's giving me some trouble. So maybe that could be a little fix. Maybe you can use alternate mouse and keyboard, but I'm not seeing my left bumper or anything like that switching anything else, which sucks. So that's, that's whack. So anyway, let's just take that for now. Salute you too. Frontier space is what we Rangers like to call the no colonization areas trench systems between the Union and Commonwealth territories. The Rangers were formed with the goal of keeping the NCA peaceful, lawful, and safe for trade. One of the most lawless spaces is this, the Sparta system, which has long been a hub of criminal activity and the home of sparring pirate factions. Being a pilot for the Rangers means putting yourself on the front line, whether you're ready or not. It means being courageous, being a hero. At least that's what my brother told me when he joined. Living up to our family's reputation of being ace pilots. It's been five years since I joined the Rangers, but this will be my first time stepping out as a Ranger pilot, not an engineer. I'll start at Halberd 1, Central Command. Just hope I get the chance to face the bastards who shot my brother down in cold blood. <laughs> well, you see there, guys, it's, it's telling you about a backstory of, of your character. There's a lot of things going on right now. <laughs> and um, apparently you have some revenge. Oh, what's up with the camera? Okay, there you go. You have some revenge out for someone who killed your brother. But you know, if if you did not get this memo, yes, this is a spoilers alert here, guys. So please use precaution when you're watching this video. If you don't want to ruin it and want to play it first off, cool. But I'm just giving you what what they're released so far because it's hard to play an NFT game that a lot of people, um, a lot of de developers say that they have, but yet they don't have anything at all. They will just show clip it and stuff, and then you find out they rugged the project. But as we know, Blowfish is a um, long-standing um, game company, so they're, I doubt they'll do that ever, but here you go. This is the game. Let's go right into it. This calm device, pick it up. Target practice. Okay, so the target practice. Oh, this is nice. This is the menu for it. Um, in game for your characters, you, got, you have player. Oh, the different perks and points. I have zero right now. This is fantastic. Weapon reload speed is slightly decreased, accuracy increased. And if you can shoot, that wouldn't be any problem. What's that? Oh, that's humans kill. So you can kill other humans. So I assume other mechs hold other humans. Uh, Oh, it would be in other aliens or something. Unless, I mean, let's say two farms going rogue or something. Oh, you got your mech? I don't have a mech yet. Don't assume because I haven't seen one yet. Your current map location. Target practice. Target practice. This is where I am. The location galaxy map okay i think the galaxy map could look a little bit better the interface seems very smooth i like this i like that the layout i like this layout as well um but i think the target map could use some sort of um adjustment maybe it's just me maybe um asking for two months but the map of a galaxy seems a bit too bland. Maybe they just have it the way it is, just because they don't want to put too much emphasis on it, and then they ruin the whole real game when it comes out. But um, if you ever played, um, if you guys want to go right ahead and take a look at Warframe, Warframe has a really nice um, layout for their their solar system, where you can travel to different planets, maps. 
if I'm used to something that that impressive. So you know, if I got my standards high, I'm um, sorry. Sorry, Blowfish, I didn't mean to, but um, I think they can use a little bit more artwork here. Characters, I assume you can have more than one character. I'm not sure we can level them up. Patience, details, awesome. And data banks. All right, we got data banks and stuff that you can pick up off the ground and read some content. Figure out the lore of this game. So oh, we got a device. All right, I would just want to follow instructions for this one. I'm if, if, you, don't, if you don't know me too well, um, I'm a, like a looter. I like exploring any and every place, looking for Easter eggs. But I'm not gonna do that for this one. I'm just gonna follow. Um, oh, you can run. That's awesome. Can you jump? Nope. Can you roll? Nope. Nothing else. I'm gonna follow the area. Go to the target practice, and then I'll explore in my own time. I'm shooting a video here. Service have come up a bit choppy for you guys. Because it is a bit choppy for me. I wonder if I can, can I adjust something like that? Maybe I can adjust the quality. Medium. Medium. Shadows, maybe I turn off shadows. I don't need shadows. Shadows is not necessary. Back quality, posting quality. Maybe this will make it better for you guys and myself. Yeah, it's not as fancy, guys, but it's working. It looks much better now. You're not related to Will. Yes, sir. Wilhelm was my brother, sir. Damn. Just bear in mind, I turned down a few of the graphics here, guys, because um, I don't think my PC has the ability to pull the recording as well. Sorry to talk during that commentary, um, but I don't think my PC has um, the power to pull the um, run a game as seem uh, has high resolution as well as record it with OBS. So I do apologize. I have to turn down some of the graphics, but it seems to be running much smoother now. So we can just continue to play this game. And just let me know guys if you want to see more of this um, game or while I play. I think I should just pause before I start going into different things and the options on this game. Otherwise you guys are going to miss it. So let me go back and do that again. But like I said, um, let me know guys if you want to see more of this game and more spoilers, of course, just to understand, um, you know, how it is, how it plays, what uh, what it's entails and, you know, rewards from it and what NFTs you can get during this. Um, I did talk to a couple of friends of mine. They say they maxed out. They got legendary gear, epic gear and all these different types of gear. I hope that gear can be um, taken over into the real game. It would be sad that, you know, you have a bunch of um, day ones in here and, you know, you can't be able to take your progression moving forward. But I hopefully you can. So let's continue. Let me just stop talking. The assault unit of the CSF here is a balanced unit, perfect for mid range engagement with options for close and long range combat. The Buster unit, the USF Kierkegaard, Guard, is a heavy unit focused on defense and firepower. It sacrifices speed and mobility for overpowering destructive force. Oh, that's hard. I love a DPS. I'm not gonna lie. But for this game, I'll go with the original guy. This mech here because um, for one, he's balanced and I don't like to be too chunky of a boy. Just, you know, moving slow around the place.
like a balance because the thing with the when you're picking a mac you need to think about um guns because if this is anything like any other um mac game you will have weapons that you can one shot people with so having a nice mac that who is very mobile and then having picking up a nice weapon that's very powerful can work out in your benefit Boosters. Right. Is there a rule? All right, your ship has thrusters. Press, press and hold forward to increase thrusters. Press and hold backward to decrease thrusters. Make your ship stop. Use left and right to pilot um, the ship. Left and right. Okay, awesome. I don't think that's right. I know you can stop your ship and hold it backwards and then thrusters it forwards but I don't think that does what it says it was going to do because this is ex is this the this other thrusters unless they're talking about moving and not moving but this is not moving you can actually reverse that's cool and you can actually move forward so I guess moving forward or ex um, acceleration uh, would be speed boost. And then pulling your left stick back will be staying one place or reverse. Pushing it forward means move forward. And right stick is moving up and down, left and right. All right, we got some action. What are we shooting? Uh, oh well that went well <laughs> wow rushed right in there guns blazing let's try this again <laughs> all right let's skip awesome all right don't any other things because you can blow yourself up apparently Where is it? Where is it? Ah, there it is. How are you feeling, Ezra? I am loving it, sir. Perfect. Now we can start the real training. I'm sending some drones your way. Let's use this. And them. And them. This won't happen twice, buddy. As soon as they teach me how to dodge, that would be nice. Shields, does my shield generate? I don't think so. Get out of here. Pull around. Ah, there he is. Maybe because how I turn down the graphics, they seem further away than I think. But when I get close, they seem really, really close.
I wonder if there's like a zoom. Oh shit, isn't it? I put a co-op against you, Captain. Alright, Captain. I'll see you, Captain. Okay, what's, what's going on? That was my controller. Okay. Seems that I lost something on my controller. It bugged out for a second there. Yeah, that was weird. Had to plug it out and plug it back in. All right, let's get into it. Who is doing it again? What is going on? Captain. Captain won't keep his ass still. Keep your ass still, Captain. Get me one hit. Let me get one hit, Captain. Damn. Off my game with these space games. I can see why they want EMSS now. Bam. What are these stuff? This. This. Oh, armor repair and I guess boost repair. Oh, I just figured out how to dodge it. All right, double tap X. All right, cool. Oh. This music is nice though. Where's the cooldown for this? Does it show? No, it stays infinity, but there's a cooldown. I hope no one gets motion sickness from all of my spinning upside down. Oh, come on. Dang. Yep. Got you. Oh, hey, okay, okay. Hey, got you. Nice. 
Alright. Oh, I had rockets this whole time, buddy. Check this out. I can lock on with him. Is there only missile? You can't get anything. You lock on. Don't do that. I don't think that lock on is working. Oh, where is Cap? Oh, 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 nice one. Nice dodge. Nice dodge, buddy. All right. Mm-hmm. Pick that up, boss. I got you that time. One more of them rockets and you're done. Uh-huh. Dang, I'm gonna lie around right at him. Uh... So I'm just trying to get through this stage for you guys. The intro. <laughs> but it seems like I am not as good as I thought I am. Nope, I don't see him. Now I do. Hmm, I think they're off. You appear. I think the markers will be easy identifiable on them. It's hard to see that red square. Sucks because they locked away my rockets. Oh, 
Okay, go. Run into him, I'm gonna blow up. To run for me, Captain. Go, Captain. Go. Ha! <laughs> One shot you, bro. Alright, now I can change my farm. Hey. Still dodge the left, right? Ooh. I don't like how the aim is right into the thing. When I move. Go, boss. Oh no, it's doing that thing again. I'm gonna have to get a new Xbox controller or something. Sorry to interrupt your call. 
Rockets are really overpowered. All right, we just completed practice mode. That was <laughs> funny enough. And one second. Keep up the good work. Now go check in with Penaway at the command service center. I'll see you soon. Thank you, sir. All right, I'm gonna save it here, guys. Save, awesome. So that is pretty much it, guys. I am going to Cut it off right here for now. Um, so that was pretty interesting. That was pretty cool. Um, I, we now we know that I suck at space games, but <laughs> I will get into that and and play better. Um, I do I do do like weird jacks on Warframe. If you play Warframe, guys, I know I talk about it a few times. Where I do like Warframe is for a free to play game, but then there's a pay to win aspect in it that that part i really don't like but however you know um, everyone's doing it so i was might as well join them but it's a pretty good good game if you don't want to pay to win basically pay for warframes you can um, farm them by doing the grind yourself so that's pretty much it that i have for you guys it, again if you like this content if you like what you saw just now and you want some more of this um phantom galaxy guys let me know i will be playing this game i want to get the nfts i want to level up and get my gear in there and i'm hoping i'm hoping blowfish if you guys see this um, video that you will allow all of our day oneers to just take all of our progress and put it into the real game uh, once it's ready for launch that would be epic i'm sure a lot of the people in the community would agree as well um but let us know um if not the nfts some of the gear if not the gear at least the nfts that we get um within the game as well so that is pretty much it um if you're not here before please hit that like hit that subscribe turn on the notification bell and um yeah catch you on the next one guys peace Thank you.